The second year of learning during the COVID-19 pandemic pushed some teachers to the breaking point today. Classes at Nathan Hill Elementary in Cleveland were canceled today due to what we're being told is a staff sick out. News 5's Caroline Sweeney is there in Caroline. This all comes on the heels of a staffer's confirmed death there. Yeah, Courtney and Rob, that's right. So just yesterday, CMSD confirmed the death of a staff member here, but they wouldn't go into details about that death. And just today, enough teachers decided to call out sick that classes had to be canceled here. A source tells News 5 that staff called out because they didn't think the district was doing enough to keep them safe, but the last minute change really stressed out some families. An empty parking lot isn't what you'd expect to see outside of school before 3 p.m. on a Friday. It was the right decision, but they should have gave a warning. This innocuous Facebook post from the Cleveland Metro School District went up around 7 a.m. Nathan Hale is closed. There will be no remote learning. Teachers at the school tell News 5 they're staging a sick out after COVID cases were detected, but families weren't ready for the last minute change. Joan Broom Jones says she has one grandchild who goes to Nathan Hale. Well, yes, yeah, she had went to the school this morning. Yeah, they go in time enough to catch breakfast and they have breakfast at 805. With only a 20 minute warning, Jones says her family was able to adapt to the cancellation today. Well, it haven't been too bad. She been on. She was on her tablet learning and doing a little sum. Jones knows the last minute change wasn't easy on all families. There are 52 people listed as staff from the school. In a statement, the district said staffers were quote nervous about COVID-19. An alert posted on the school's page on September 27th says a case of COVID was found in the school. The district dashboard shows 14 cases in the school so far this year, including four new staff cases. Well, within the last 30 minutes, I just finished speaking with the teachers union president, Sherry Obretsky, and she tells me that staff members here at Nathan Hale have been through a tough week and the second year of pandemic learning is, quote, a whole new kind of difficult. No one from the district was willing to go on camera with us today, but they did send us a detailed list of their cleaning procedures here at Nathan Hale and Rob, people looking for that list can find it on our website, news5cleveland.com. A tough week indeed. Caroline Sweeney, thank you so much.